hidden gem in the Arizona desert where red rock mountains and lush green landscapes collide. A city known for vibrant colors, western vibes, and unique style. John, Mackenzie, and I started off our day in this rocky terrain with a fast-paced Jeep ride filled with jolts of excitement and adrenaline around every corner. As good of a time as we were having, the Jeeps could only take us so far. Eventually, the road stopped at paths that could only be explored by foot. With the sun beating down, legs getting heavy, and hardly anything left in the tank, we pushed through with the energy we had left and were rewarded with a view that was well worth it. With the mindset that our day was coming to a close, we spotted a dude ranch on the other side of the ridge. It was in that moment that we realized our Sedona adventure would not be complete until we saddled up ourselves. With that, it was back down the mountain for us. We hopped back into the Jeeps and off we went. Pulling up to the ranch, we were greeted by a few cowboys who were more than happy to pass the reins on to us rookies. They paired us up with our horses for the day and we set off for the Rocky Mountainside. You see, we'd heard the old saying, if you fall off a horse, you get back up and try again. And we thought, running a horse can't be that difficult. But in no time, we stood corrected. Luckily, none of us ended up on the ground trampled but a few of us got close. If I'm being honest, it was a pretty tough ride, but the rocks and uneven surfaces were quickly forgotten when we saw the payoff of reaching the top. This reminded my friends and I of specific moments in our own lives where we've gone through tough times and didn't see the final result until we persevered through the difficulties along the way. God may have a plan for our lives that just hasn't been revealed to us yet. It's those times in our lives where character is built. We learn the most about ourselves when we push through rather than backing out and giving up. It's not gonna be easy. Try taking it one day at a time. You don't need to have your whole life mapped out at this point. Take it one challenge after the next. Make little improvements and set goals for yourself every day along the way. Do this, and when you look back, you'll see yourself gradually becoming the person you are meant to be. We are confirmed in this when we read Romans 5, 3, and 4. We know that suffering produces perseverance, Perseverance, character, and character, hope. Just like with our climb up the mountain, when you weigh the results of the struggles and the outcome that comes from the growth gained from it, more often than not, it's worth it. <laughs>